Um, to me, in, in my opinion, um, the most important part to learn congas is mm, learn the technique, the foundation. If you have the technique foundation uh, complete, uh, you have all in your hands and uh, you can uh, learn all what you want reading, send video, music videos, listen music, but if you have the technique and you know, really know the sounds of your instrument, uh, how play your sounds, you, you can play whatever you want. Then uh, I'm gonna show you the basic sounds and um, what is that the, ba the basic sounds and um, how playing, okay? The basic sounds to play congas, uh, the most of the patterns that uh, everybody play around the world uh, are the bass sound or uh, palm sound, because we play with the palm of our hand. This is the sound, bass or palm. Finger sound. Open tone, slap tone. To me, this is the basic sounds. We can get another sounds like this, or like this, or the open slap, like this, or the muffled sound, the most used to play rumba style. Uh, but now I'm gonna show you just bass, finger, uh, slap and open. With these sounds we can uh, play the most of uh, grooves or patterns where you play in the Latin or world music uh, sounds, okay? Now, I'm gonna show you how to uh, take the bass sound, okay? The bass, to, to play the bass sound we need to focus on a couple things. The first one, relaxed. We need to be relaxed. Um, take care with the shoulder, your elbow, need to be relaxed. This is the right position, you can practice that. Just relax and just drop your hands, like dead hands. And do it again. This is the right position, not that. This is a wrong position or that. It's the wrong position. You need to be relaxed. Okay? Sit straight. You know that. Try to play in that position the most of times. Okay? And then we're gonna get the bass tone or palm tone. We're gonna use all our hand. When I said palm, I said all my hand. All the hand. Not that. Some people play with that way, but this is wrong. You don't play la that. You play that. Okay? It's not that. That's wrong. That's right. This is the skin. This is my hand. When I play, I use this contact. All the hands are in contact with the skin. This is really important to know. Okay? Then we're gonna play with all our hand in this direction. We're gonna do that. Check it out how is my movement. Slow. And pay attention about the sound. basic exercise to get the bass tone or palm tone remember you need to play with all your hand at the same time and you leave up first here not your fingers not that or that is that and you're gonna do that exercise a lot of time then you're gonna switch to the left hand and you're gonna do exactly the same no, Dad. Just here. This is the bass tone, and you're gonna, you need to pay attention um, about the position of conga. You need to have the conga a little bit up because you need to have that 
check it out there because if you put two down you're gonna do that and you have less movement the angle need to be like that okay then we're gonna play fingers to play fingers you stay your hand on the skin all the time the head is in on the skin and you're gonna practice that too then you're gonna practice with your left hand then maybe uh, three or four days after you're gonna play that and you're not gr growing the speed and you go down again up and down up and down okay then we're gonna play um, we have bass fingers okay now we're gonna do an exercise to play both together when you really have the sound and you can play good this sound and this one uh, you're gonna play maybe two weeks after you start to practice in every day um, bass bass finger finger bass Bass, finger, finger, okay? And you're gonna grow in this um, sound too. Uh, every week you're gonna grow and uh, pick it up uh, five and um, five BPM in your metronome. It's one, two, three, da. Bass, bass, finger, finger. Bass, bass, finger, finger. Every week you pick it up. Then you're gonna practice another exercise. You're gonna put one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and. Both hands, Let's start with the right, play the several minutes to the right hand, then you switch to your left hand and when you have that, you're gonna put uh, 16 notes. One, two, three, four. One and two and three and four. And one and the two and the three and the four and one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one and the two and three and the four and the one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one and same thing with the left hand you're gonna play right hand first left hand bad when you play just one two and one and two and you're gonna play every week growing up too when you are really fast you go down in your metronome and you start to play um, with the um, 16 notes then you're gonna put uh, when you have the three notes you're gonna put triplets too and you're gonna put them that way one Three, four, one and two and three and four and three play the three play the three play the three play one and the two and the three and the four and the one, two, three, four, one and two and three and four and three play the three play the three play three play the one and the two and the three and the four and the same thing. You start with one speed and growing up every week, maybe five or 10 if you can BPMs every week if you practice every day and start with the right hand then the left hand and you have a lot of exercise to practice in this in this way we're gonna do now open tone this is open tone okay the snare drum is bothering me perfect we're gonna play the open tone, the way to play open tone. I play the open tone with this part of my hand. If you see, I use exactly this part of my hand. Where my fingers are, that's where I, the part what I use to play 
the skin an open tone. And this is what I'm doing with this part of my hand and a little bit leave, leave up the, my fingers check the position I don't touch the hardware with my hand I don't, I didn't do that I need to take the harmonic on the edge of the conga just in the point where the edge start to go down the, on the wood this is the point where I'm gonna play pay attention your fingers leave it up, leave it up but not that, that's wrong just a little, to so don't touch here is not that rest here don't touch with the hardware you move just your hand and play to get the sound you're gonna take more time than others but the patience is good and you're gonna start to play in slow and slow and slow when you have the sound in your right hand you switch to your left hand start to do the same thing and you're gonna practice that then you're gonna pick it up the speed the same thing every day it's a, another day just one hand then we're gonna play slap this is the slap, close the slap. How we gonna take the sound? We're gonna play the same way like we play the open tone, but just in the moment when we take the skin, we're gonna press with our fingers and uh, we're gonna pull with our fingers and we're gonna push with our hand. It's not that hard, but uh, I doing that so you can see what I'm doing. You know, it's like I'm, it's like I want to catch the conga. And we're gonna play with all this part of my hand here. One very important: this bone between this and this, in the middle, we're gonna play just the edge of the conga. And we're gonna put all the finger from here to there in contact with the skin the second finger we're gonna leave a little space in the middle without touch the third a little bit more and the fourth a little bit more the thumb it's up and we play like you would want to catch okay this is the slap tone and finally we're gonna um, play exercise to combine open tone with a slap tone like that open slap open slap open slap open slap same thing with the left hand open slap open slap open slap okay this is the sounds why i say it is the most important sounds because we can play the most rhythms the most popular rhythm is marcha rumba tumbao they have a, a different name salsa and I'm gonna play and this have all the sounds bass finger slap finger open open bass finger slap finger open open bass finger slap finger open open okay it's a pleasure to me can share this um, lessons with you it's a very compressed uh, class but I hope you enjoy and that help you and if you want some question uh, please send me an email I'm gonna answer all the questions what you want okay bye good luck